The host of the religious program, Success in Life, now has a less than successful marriage. Robert Tilton announced yesterday he and his wife will seek a divorce. Alan Berg reports on the latest of Tilton's trials. Robert Tilton hinted of change. Don Flowers is coming to minister the word of God and then, then we'll be sharing some other things. Don? So did Tilton's second in command, Don Clowers. There's been a move of God here in the church for the past few weeks, and I just believe that move is going to get greater and stronger. But the bombs did not drop until after the televised portion of the service ended. At that point, Clowers announced he was leaving the church, and Tilton announced he and his wife were separating. The church is really not in any, any nature of disarray. These are just two announcements that happened at the same time. When God ordains a church, that church goes on. And God's ordained this church, so this church is going to go on. The announcements come during a period where Tilton is spending about as much time in court as in church. And where Bob went, Marty Tilton followed. How long have you been married? <laughs> 23 years. An attorney suing Tilton said Marty testified in deposition that she was general manager and administrator over church operations until early July. I knew that the fraud that was being perpetrated on the American people couldn't continue in her mind. I mean, I think she has too many morals for it to continue. We're not going to choose up sides. We're going to pray for them. Church members would not speculate on what caused a split, and church officials would not comment on how the two resignations affect day-to-day -day operations. They do say Clowers was called to become a full-time evangelist. God had been dealing with them over these months to go back out in the evangelistic field again, and so today was just that culmination of that. I'm so glad. It is a troubled time for Tilton's congregation. They've banded together to fend off assaults from the outside. Now they have to handle the pain within.